Hi, Kathleen McGinley here from Heart Rock Healing and welcome to Wednesday Wisdom. We are going to be pulling a card from the Sacred Path Cards deck based on native teachings, asking what it is that we need to know at this time. And Don't forget to subscribe and if you want to receive notifications, push the bell. And so uh, we're going to be getting centered. These cards are going to allow you to engage in self-discovery. So you're going to receive your own intuitive messages as I pull this card and then we can look at how we can apply it into our week. So asking what it is that we need to know at this time. Here's our card for this week. It's the drum card, 32. Three and two is a five. So it's going to be a week of change. And uh, it makes sense. You know, when we pull the drum card, it often means that we're out of sync. You know, we've lost our rhythm and internal timing. And, and this could be happening, you know, with a pandemic. We're sitting around and we're in our heads too much. That's what this card is saying, that the... Um, the thoughts, you know, are kind of out distancing what our body can handle. So we, we need to get everything back in sync. Okay. The mind and the body are out of rhythm. So let's talk a second about the drum though. The drum is the, the, the instrument or the tool that the Native Americans have used for a long time. And you think about it when you go back and you see them sitting around the fire and drumming. Uh, for music, for dancing, for ceremonies. Um, it, it really created this collective energy where they all were able to connect their heartbeats to each other and also their heartbeats to Mother Earth, okay? And when you think about the shamans or shamanic practitioners such as myself using the drum, uh, we use it with, with journeying. And, and journeying is a a method where we go into what's called non-ordinary reality. We work with our power animals or our spirit helpers to um, go into this trance-like state by drumming um, approximately 120 beats per minute, uh, maybe a little faster, which takes your brains into the theta state. Okay, and that allows for that altered consciousness where you might experience uh, visions, sensations, um, you know, um, images where you might get, you might be able to interpret, you know, sometimes it's metaphorically, but you can um, get the, that guidance that you need uh, for healing as you work with your spirit helpers, as an example, whether it's for yourself, whether it's for others. But, um, but the bottom line is, um, when you think of the heartbeat and the sound of the drum, the first sound you ever heard was a heartbeat in the womb of your mother as well as your own. So that drum sound can just take us right back and reconnect us, you know, with that beautiful sound that we heard when we were in the womb. And so... Knowing that this card is telling us we're a little bit out of sync, you know, we've been probably thinking, thinking, thinking a little bit too much. It's a time to shift out of that head, down into that heart space, maybe by doing some drumming and some dancing, uh, reconnecting our heartbeats with that of Mother Earth, going out into nature, slowing down, and let your heartbeat come in sync with Mother Earth's heartbeat. And when you find that rhythm, you're gonna find that life flows and pretty much becomes effortless. So that's our card for this week, the drum card. So this is Kathleen McGinley from Heart Rock Healing. Please don't forget to subscribe as I will see you again next week for some more Wednesday wisdom. Take care.